Today we are going to talk about an issue and that's my self start did not work yesterday. Hey what's up everybody welcome to my channel and in today's video we will talk about my motorcycle did not start all of a sudden. I had to push start a couple of times yesterday I went to the Yamaha guys and they found what the problem was with this and I'll share what it was. I've kept it open and ready. So the problem was with this relay. So earlier on 26th January I had this problem. My bike did not start and there was the vibrating noise like when the battery is down. And I thought it's a problem with the battery and I got the battery changed. I changed the battery. I had a new battery. And I will share the story quickly with you what happened. <clears throat> okay, this battery you see, Excite Black one. This is a used battery that I got from a dealer for 300 rupees. Okay, because I went with my old Excite battery which I got last year to charge. It got charged and it still did not work. And that was because it was not able to hold the charge. The charge drained out very quickly. And there is another story behind it. Like what happened. So I took the battery to the guy and I told him that I lost my warranty card. And he said he could not help without the warranty card. And... He, I told him that I have the bills. He was still not able to help me. He said, no, I cannot. So I sent an email to the Excite people and they replied back asking me what the issue is. And uh, when I replied back, I got a call from the service center. The main service center is here in Hyderabad, about 30 kilometers away, a place called Medchal. So I went there and they got me a new battery box pack. So this was really a great job by the Excite guys. Okay, and okay, so what happened on 26th, I'll tell you, 26th of uh, January, uh, I faced issue with the battery. So like I thought it's a battery problem. I changed it, I replaced it with the new one that I received from them and it started fine. It worked absolutely fine for that whole day. And I went to a restaurant where it, uh, where I, um, you know, turned off the ignition. I, I took it to the parking lot. I was not able to start it. So I had to push all the way to the parking lot. I op opened this. This was rusted. And then I was not able to start this. So it was quite hot. So what I did was I left it like this. And then I went after half an hour when I started, it started fine. That whole day it was fine. Again on 27th, which is yesterday, I was not able to start it. The whole thing did not work at all. I had to push start yesterday the whole day. I went to the Yamaha guys. I told them that I'm facing this problem. They took 15 to 20 minutes. They checked these and they told me that there's a problem with the loose connection. You see there is a thing they did something to this. These two relays, one is for the radiator and another is for the self -start. So I called up my friends and they told me that it could be an issue with the switch like parking, sorry, uh, the carbon gets deposited or something, some problem happens but nothing as such. I am supposed to change this, this will cost me like 120 rupees, I did not do it yesterday because tomorrow again I have to go to the Yamaha and give my bike for the fork. The fork needs to be... Uh, a fork throwing needs to be done because uh, two months back I met with an accident and I think there is an issue with the handling and all. Okay, so friends, in future, if you see any kind of problem like this, your bike doesn't start, doesn't start means like this, like when the key is off, how do you feel? It doesn't work at all. It did not work without any noise like there was no sound coming it's simply like dead but you would be able to see uh, everything on the meter would be fine just that it's not working so now it's absolutely fine you can see it just starts with one push 
all right friends so in future if you have such kind of problem do not worry just check the relay check your battery connections check the basics first okay the relay is a very small thing and like uh, you can check the relay connections as well he checked the relay connection he did not change the relay tomorrow i'm going to do this okay so friends i hope you find this video helpful and if it was give it a thumbs up like the video and do share it with other friends who might have this problem or find it helpful also subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any update next time i post anything new thank you friends hope you all have a great weekend and you enjoy your day bye bye